Right. Hope you're ready for some soppy shit. Um, <laughs> need to talk to you about something before we get going. Um, if you're not interested, you just want to skip to the football manager. I fixed the problem, by the way. I'll talk you through it. But um, if you just want to skip to the football manager bit, I will put a time code somewhere up there or down there, roundabouts there that you can click on and skip forward in the video. Um, but I'd like if you could just spend five minutes because I've got a couple of things I want to say. Um, yeah, so, okay. Ooh, hey, how do we do this then? Uh, <laughs> right. Um, so, it's not bad, by the way. It's not one of those, like, oh, my God, it's one of those YouTuber apology videos. It's 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 more of a thank you, and I just need to get out of my system. I was going to make it as a separate video, but actually, I just want to talk to you guys, these you guys that are watching <clears throat> that are watching my series up to this point. We're at episode however many, and you're still watching it and supporting me and stuff. So I do, rather than speaking to everybody that's sub to my channel and randoms who find the video, I kind of just want to speak to my sort of hardcore I'm doing crabs hardcore fans Ugh. people hardcore friends um it's not started as good as I'd hoped right let's just get in let's just let's just talk about it so at the end of yesterday's video um I said right before the credits I said something about patreon and I said about um you know sort of half jokingly sort of said about if everybody that was watching donated put a dollar up a month on Patreon, then I could afford my house quicker and all this sort of stuff. Um, and it wasn't planned at all. I didn't plan to say, I don't plan anything pretty much. Um, I just kind of said it as a half sort of jesty thing. Um, as you, as you may have noticed, if you've been a watcher of my channel, I'm not very good at asking for help. <laughs> there's, and there's two parts to it. I'm not very good at asking for help. And I also don't like to ask too much of people. Um, the whole way my channel's set up and the whole way Patreon is set up is to be as not in your face as humanly possible. Now I watch tons of YouTube. I watch way more YouTube than I do telly, and and I know it's a and I know you wouldn't be bothered, and because I, I know it's a completely regular thing to every ep every video you're telling everybody to hit the join button or the join the Patreon or buy your merch or whatever it is. Not like Logan Paul levels, like just normal human being levels of of yeah, you know support me and stuff. And I've really always struggled with that. It wasn't up until a couple of months ago that I even started mentioning Patreon by just sort of when I thank the new people sort of say that it's there if you want to check it out um and also like my Patreon if you if you check it out my Patreon is unlike any other Patreon in that you don't get anything for it you don't get behind the scenes footage or early access or stuff because I've always or like exclusive videos because I've always thought to myself that I don't want people with money getting more than anybody else you know i might have some 12 year old kid who's my biggest fan he watches every video he watches all the ads so i get a little bit of money he hits like he shares the videos and stuff but because he can't afford to give me a couple of quid on patreon each month he doesn't get access to my exclusive vlogs or whatever and i just i just hate that idea but the facts of the matter are <laughs> i need help <laughs> um the facts as a recap of current life situation, if you don't know, I am currently living with my ex-girlfriend. We broke up a couple of months ago, um, Curly, as you know her, and her ex-husband. Okay? Um, and we all, to be fair, we all get on okay. We all we all get on all right, um, considering the history and everything. Um, you know, they were, were married many years ago, um, and then they broke up, but they had a house together, and neither of them could afford to move, so that happened, and they became sort of just housemates, and then we got into a relationship, I moved in, and, and all that sort of stuff, and, and, and that's that was all fine, but now, obviously, I've got an ex and an ex-ex, it's like she's racking them up, it's like a guest house of ex-boyfriends at this point. Um, I don't like it, I have good days and bad days. Most of the days are okay. And some days I feel like shit and I want to escape. Other days it's fine. Um, but as things are progressing, it's kind of 
it, it's a tough time for everybody. Um, Curly's going through some depression at the moment. She's given up work, but and I'm trying to sort of help her as best I can as an ex-boyfriend that got dumped by, you know, with two hours notice, if you have seen that video. Um, and, you know, she's not working, so there's no money coming in. So um, I'm paying now sort of, we agreed a certain amount of rent I'm paying towards the mortgage and everything like that. But there's now... Um, because she can't afford even to pay her side of things. Like, f for instance, for the last three weeks, I've been, I've personally paid for all the food for everyone in the house. Um, so the ex-girlfriend that screwed me over, I'm now buying food for and her ex-husband because um, I try to be a good person. And, and I know she's going through some shit and stuff like this, but I need to, at some stage, get out. Um, so, yeah. If if you can for a couple of quid on Patreon, I'm I'm fighting my way through this because I hate asking for stuff like this. Um, but only if you can afford it and all that sort of stuff. Couple of quid on Patreon. I've got to thank a bunch of people because I said that thing yesterday, and a massive load of you have already signed up to Patreon, and it took me aback a bit today. It was really it was really oh, not gonna cry, not gonna cry. Um, you know when I went to check it. It was amazing, um, and it means a lot. And I know that I'm kind of I try to be open and honest with you, my current feelings and stuff like this. And um, you know, I'm feeling better flu wise, so I'm hoping to get back into it. Like the stream starting again on Friday and stuff. Um, but I've I've got to I've got to what's the word i don't know what the word is i've got basically i've got to be more forward and i'm not saying throw stuff in your face right but i've got to be i've got to make it okay for me to say to you hey guys please support me on patreon if you like what i do blah 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 and and be okay with that just mentioning every video just like a couple of seconds not enough to annoy anybody <laughs> you know um but because uh, for the size of my channel, my Patreon is ridiculously huge. Considering you get nothing for it apart from a name in the credits, right? My and 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 like I'm, I'm incredibly grateful for that. And ho and hopefully it won't be a. I'm, I don't want to be a rich guy. I don't care. I just want to have my own house where I can look after dogs. Um, <laughs> you know, and obviously now the house thing. Before it was going to be two people's wages going forward onto into it into the mortgage, and now it's going to be just me. Therefore, it's a, it's up to the amount required for like deposit and stuff. I've been saving for the deposit for like, ever since I started YouTube. I'd say ninety percent of money that's not gone into bills and stuff has gone on to savings and everything. And, you know, the 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 nice computer I got is the only ever a big expense I've ever bought for myself since I started YouTube. It's always been the goal. Um, and now it, it was a couple goal and now it's my goal. And, and so if you can chuck a couple of quid, oh, I hate, <laughs> but I, <laughs> yeah, if you can chuck a couple of quid on Patreon, that'd be amazing. But like I said, do not feel in the slightest bit, um, guilty if you can't, like there's tons of people in way, 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 way worse situations than me, um, you know, I've just got a really awkward and horrible living situation, but there's, there's like ton, I'm not saying feel pity for me. It's just that I have to be okay with asking you guys if you want to support me like that. And I know if for, for most of you watching, you probably watch a lot of YouTube and you're so used to that. You're so used to all these Raid Shadow Legends sponsorships and all this other shit and stuff. I turn all of those down because most of it is at a shit tat that I don't want to advertise. And I'll, that's not going to change because I'm just not going to do that. I have integrity that I'm going to keep hold of um but I have to be okay with just mentioning it mentioning it to you every now and then I have to get over my own stupidity and weirdness and asking for help and stuff and uh yeah so just know that pretty much things like how generous people are on twitch and ad revenue that pretty much covers things like you know credit cards rent dog food, all that sort of stuff, right? That pretty much covers my outgoings for the month. Every penny currently that that I'm earning on Patreon is going into my savings bank account towards my deposit on a house. So so just so you're clear where it's going. It's not to fuel my drug and prostitute habit. 
that's very small. All right. <laughs> so, yeah, I just want to say thank you. I'm going to name a bunch of names now that literally just signed up in the last couple of days. Um, and, yeah, before I cry, because I'm going to. Right, Max from Luxembourg, Henry Ryder, Ilan or... Lan, I can't tell if that's capital I or an L. Thank you very much. Anders Lind upped his pledge. David Sigurdsson upped his pledge hugely. Battle Atlas upped his pledge. Luca Mizuric, Ant Atwood, Hugh Jars. That's Hugh Jars. I see what you've done there. Don, Bradley Cook, The Dons, Ray Brown's Bass Method. I keep wanting to say Bass Method. Uh, Edward Arnett, <coughs> Hapex, Lego Menen Menon. Lego Menon. <coughs> Can't do it. Sean Saunders, the oh, Agetal Matten. That's wrong. James Hurley, Liam Williams, Drasilix, Ben Davis, Rory Davidson, Damian Rowland, Aidan Kirk, Ian Ross, Harrison Mitchell, Leo Petrov, Thomas Van Nort, Chris Towers, Super Mega Fudge Gaming. Amazing names. Muad Emadi, uh, Chris White, Prince upped his pledge. Carrie Raviella, Great Stupendo. I loved it. Anders. Thurkelson, Yuval, oh, these names, I, I apologise, <laughs> Yuval Calderon, Daniel Delimihailis, smashed it, uh, Luke Yass, or Jass, Cohen Spearings, Jock McTavish, Dustin Slinning, Daniel Binnell, Tiago de Cruz, Ben Zinn, Rian jo Godfrey, Vince the Prince, Boris Greninowitz, Goran Birkland, Philip Dungan, Aaron Gearing, Ian Wassler, Selling Straws, Mohammed Naffel, Supercooled Gaming, McToady, Weku is a twat. <laughs> I like somebody signed up to, to insult somebody. One Snickers to Loki Doki, thank you. Lars Kittlesbratten, Lucas Medoris, Hans Ha <laughs> Ha. Well, that, I, I failed that. I, I, I bailed on that name. <laughs> Hans Hauerzl. Is that Dutch? And Andrew Park. That's just in the last couple of days. You guys are absolutely superstars. Thank you so much. That's like $270 worth of extra ink savings. Um, so over the course of... I'm hoping to get this done by Christmas. That's nine months. So if that was to stay, that 200 I'm going to... Oh, no, I'm going to do maths in a video. $270, 10 weeks, right, is 2700 so let's say 30 weeks is 6,000, 7,100. So it's like seven and a half, eight grand. Is that right? <laughs> it's extra money. And th and that's amazing, guys. So ooh, a little bit off shoulder number. Sorry. Don't want to turn you on. Um, yeah. So, um, yeah, just thank you. Um, I'm You allow me to do my dream job. I'm a 42-year-old bloke. That at 38 discovered that he wanted to be a YouTuber and make silly videos on the internet. I was a late bloomer, and you guys have, your guys' support has made me, allowed me to do this for a living. So, um, thank you. Let's, let's go play some football manager. Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back to The Journeyman. I said five minutes. What was it like 13 minutes later? I'm sorry that you had to sit through that. I apologise. Right, so we fixed it. We did the classic go on holiday for a day to fix it. There's a lot of people saying, bottom right, change it to the, to the competition. But this doesn't actually do anything, so I'm not quite sure what you're trying to refer to. And also, I think the the problem is the Europa 2 League, Euro 2 League, as you can see, doesn't appear in here, despite the fact I'm in it. Um, am I in it? Is it just broken? Or does it, we might not know the results yet. It says I'd, I'd done a squad. Hang on. Yeah, so I skipped a day. Um, we may, uh, may make one change to their squad. The player list has been submitted. So we have submitted it, which is good. I'm hoping they submitted the right players. That'd be funny, wouldn't it? If the, the assistant manager's like, yeah, this will be a fun, this will be a funny joke. Um, 
So I'm I'm sure that it's just it's fine. I'm sure that's just going to come up when all the other games have been played. Like the draws not happened yet, I guess. Or the Euro Cup Two League is just broken mess, and we'll just have to find out. Right, just going to do one game today because it's the important one, and I've already waffled on for thirteen minutes. So apologies for that. Perkovic has signed a new contract because there was another team interested in in which I rejected. Then and he's like, oh, give me more money then. Absolute twat. <clears throat> For anyone wondering, yes, I have just this evening watched Liverpool get knocked out of the Champions League. <laughs> we played so well. And then Adrian just went, ah, fuck it. I'm going to little gift to my fellow Spaniards. Um... Right, okay, this is it. Right, this is it. To celebrate you guys' generosity, we are going to beat Dynamo Zagreb in the league for the first time since 1906, probably. Something like that. Definitely not overreacting. All right, we rested some players. How's Alan? Um, okay, Rosic can come back. Okay. Perkovic... Oh, hang on, is they still injured? Uh, Billy Ray Byrus is still out. Perks is back, which is good. So we're going to... Wiley Byrus only scored one goal this season, and that was from right wing. Bogdan. I, I was trying to roll back the years and hopefully that he was going to come good. We're going to stick with the formation for now. Let's not just immediately bail on it, right? It's It's done us well over the years. Um, give Alan a game. Kerich needs to, maybe the wrong time, but yeah, more. Oh, Murray's dead anyway. That's fine. That that. Uh, and we want Leonard as a playmaker. And Hasek is probably. Everybody's playing a bit of shit. If we lose today, boys, <laughs> let me just uh check on our Portuguese friends. <laughs> Just in case, like, just, 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 it just, like, uh, coincidence. It's, they're stable. That's good. They're not, they're not any better. So, oh, win, loss, and a draw. It was sporting, wasn't it? That was the team. Yeah. Okay. So, if we lose today, which is, like, most likely case. <laughs> okay, it's fine. Right. How's it? Everybody's where they should be. Okay. I've only got seven substitutes. Good stuff. Right, come on, boys. Come on. This is the time. This is when we need it most. This is really needed. Morale boost. Oh, I'm not confident at all. Maybe this is... Because normally we're battling for him and it's like, oh, who's going to win the league and win that big game and... Now it's like, oh, relegation battle. <laughs> Go on, battle for it, battle for it. Loving that, KP. <laughs> Fucking hell, KP. Two minutes in. Might have scored too early. Oh, yeah, and the mugs will be on sale at some point as well. <laughs> I've just got to package them all up. Oh, look at that, KP. Oh, what a finish. Okay, now we go full defences. We Atletico Madrid this, do we? Just... Play really defensive for the next 80 minutes. I'm not bitter. This is it. I've got a good feeling about this. This would make perfect sense. The one time we're playing absolute shit, we go and beat Dynamo Zagreb. Perfect logic, isn't it? They've not had a shot on target. Oh, Hasek's on yellow already. Alan's a bit dead. Perks is a bit dead. But, oh, 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 go on. On half time. Back post. That's not a highlight. Don't just lump it up the field and score. And also, I'm going to get working on my secret FM project. Okay. I put it off for a bit because of house looking for houses and stuff like that. And But I, I, I feel like I owe it to you guys. To, to get my this project done because it's going to be something you've never seen before in football manager circles. Oh, no. No. 
Go, oh, he's fired it wide. It will take me some time, but I'll, I'll get working on it. I promise. Right, one nil up. One minor scare. I'm taking Hasik off because he's about to get himself sent up. Ebro can come on for Alan. Perks can just suck it up for a bit. Let's just go. What's up? Okay, let's just go cautious. Give him a bit of praise. Is this... Is this it? Is this the moment? I'm speaking too soon, aren't I? Clearly, Rosic making a save. It's a good day to be alive. <clears throat> All right. That's fine. I think they can have it there. They can have it there. Just defend this. Maybe try and head the ball. Oh, come on. When do we change it up? No, not yet. It's too early. Oh, oh that's so lucky. He fell right. He's off the crossbar and it's just fallen to him. Oh, no. We're going to actually have to fashion another sh chance now. Have we, how many shots have we had? Two. Doesn't look good now, does it? Oh, hang on. Ebra, find the ball. Short pass. There we go. Hranjek. Is he going to do something useful? No. Yes, he is. Ebra. Good ball. KP. Off the crossbar. We're not going to have many chances, boys. we got to make them count. Come on, Perks. Ugh. Okay. Just passed to the manager. Okay. Okay. Coming back into it. They want this. The lads want this. To be honest, at this point, I'd really take a draw. Like, our form. Oh, my God, he's missed it. I was just checking offside. I was sure he was going to score. I was waiting. F I was looking for a flag. Oh, my God. They're hanging on. They're hanging on. Another injury. They've used all their subs. Now we go attacking. Right, uh, Bobby for Perks. Miley Byra swaps to the right. Let's go, let's go. Got to go for it, lads. Got to go for it. Come on. I'm not going crazy. Like, this is still a good result. But we're in with a chance. This is it. Is this it? Get there, get there. Bow, bow. Oh, Miley. Okay, okay, nice. Is this the moment? Is this it? KP launches one forward. Bobby, he's through. He browns the keeper. It's a great save. We might not get another chance for 40 years, lads. KP, back post. Oh, no, the counter-attack. No, no, don't. Oh my god, they are really hanging on. Ever since the equalised, they've been shit. Miley Byrus. Miley. Oh, I thought that was going to be a penalty. <sighs> okay, well we drew. Which is in and of itself the way we performed this season. I'll take that. And bonus balls. We caused two injuries. So fingers crossed, it's a couple of leg breakers and stuff. And that will weaken our rivals. We've only one game in five. We've got a game in hand, though, lads. We're going to fly up the league. What a goal that was from him, though. That was bloody decent. Right. I'm I'm assuming the Euro 2 Cup is happening. Um, I've registered... My assistant has maybe registered a team. Um, I'm, I'm just guessing that they still get the games on going. It doesn't look like it, does it? We will find out next episode. <laughs> yes, he's he's deserving of a call up. You say I say yes to that every single fucking time. Of course he's deserving to it. And then the their manager comes, the national manager comes out and says, "I don't think he's very good." We go round and round. But this guy should be in the national team. Right there we go, my friends. Thank you for listening to me witter on for thirteen minutes. Probably. Longer than the actual football manager part, which is, I think, maybe a new record for me. Like, the intro is longer than the actual 
main body of the video. I'm not sure that's how it's supposed to work, but uh, like I said, <coughs> I appreciate it. You guys are superstars, and thank you for giving me a purpose. I know it sounds like a big deal when it's just a guy making YouTube videos, but thank you for giving me a purpose in life. It really is that big for me. I love you all very much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.